Hi, just got back from the gym. Gonna jump in the shower, rinse off, rinse my face, and we'll get started. Awesome. Okay, this video is for anyone who, like me, has breakouts or dark spots or pigmentation or sunspots or just, this is just for you to find out if Lumen is for you. Let's see if it works for me. I have a whole plethora of routines, but for about the next two weeks, I'm just going to use these three products. So my ultimate goal is to clear up my face, <laughs> but I want to help anyone in the process who's looking for some advice or some help to do the same thing. So today we're going to try this product, Lumen. Crazy enough, it's Christmas time or near Christmas time and there's a free trial and free, um, only paid for shipping. So what they send me <coughs> were these three, were these three products. So they're right here. Boom. Very cool. Very cool box. So we're gonna start with the cleanser, the charcoal cleanser. No, right here. Charcoal cleanser. All right. It looks like this. Boom. Again, I'm gonna read it. It says, lather the charcoal cleanser between wet hands and massage the foam into your face. <coughs> Rinse off with lukewarm water and pat face dry with a towel. Okay. Oh, here we go. Let's start. I don't know how much to use, so I'm just gonna use about enough to go on my middle finger. Wet hands, I have warm water running. Gonna rub it, and here we go. Rub it all over my face. That well, smells pretty good. It smells very, um, sparkly. But uh, it's very thick. It does foam up very well. I'm not sure how long it's supposed to be on your face. That'd be good instructions to have, but you know, I'm gonna go on my neck too because that's a very important part of your face. People forget that sometimes that their neck is part of their face. So we're just gonna let that sit. All right, it says with lukewarm water, pat and dry. So I'm gonna let it sit for like 10 seconds, and then we're just gonna go, we're gonna pat it off. All right, as you can see, I rinsed it off. Not really a lot of residue. Oh, some under here. So a very important thing that I've realized um, is when you pat your face dry with a towel, it should be a clean towel. I know that sounds weird, but a lot of people use their bathing towel or their drying towel and they forget like, oh, there could be bacteria on there too. So I'm making sure that I use a very clean, brand new, actually towel. Go to Walmart, $1.88, very easy. You get like 22 of them. Okay, so my skin is dry. <clears throat> and I forgot to mention earlier, they have, a, a, I guess, a selection if your skin is dry and flaky, if you have normal skin or you have oily-based skin. My skin is very oily, so that is the, I guess that is the products that they gave me to best fit that type of skin. Okay, so as for right now, my skin feels very like dry, not dry, but yeah, no, it feels dry. That's how it feels, which is I'm not normal, not used to it. Like I said, very oily skin. If I didn't show you before, my problem spots are my temples, as you can see. My forehead, I get a lot of breakout up here. And over here, this is just the worst right there. A lot of like dark spots. As far as my cheeks are concerned and my the frontal part of my face, it's pretty good. I don't break out at all over there. I have a small blemish right there, but in the middle of my eyebrows, oh, they're just the worst. Okay, let's see what the beautiful exfoliating rub looks like. Okay, so here we go. We're gonna try this next part. Oh, goodness. So this is the um, exfoliating rub. Huh? So it says, massage, not rub, but massage. So I'm gonna put it on my palms. That's not, it doesn't look like a lot, but I think it is. Okay. It actually wasn't enough. So I'm gonna use that same amount more. And just really, really try to get everywhere on my face, using my fingers and my whole hand. Now it says to do this for 30 seconds until you feel the product ball off. All right, well, I don't know what that means, but we are going to find out. Okay. This actually smells pretty good too. Mm, it just looks shiny, huh? I don't know where the ball is gonna start, but I'm just gonna keep massaging until Oh, okay, I can feel it. I feel it. There are little, 
that you can see on my fingers, there's like little balls of the product forming as I rub it into my face. So I'm assuming that's, it kind of feels weird. It kind of feels like it's the dirt on your face and you're scrubbing it off, you know? But I'm just gonna, I'm gonna push through it. I'm a very strong person. We're just gonna get through it. Okay, it's been about 30 seconds. Time to rinse off again. Again, don't forget your clean towel. Pat dry. Um, again, my skin still feels very dry. So, I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. Maybe it means it's clean. I'm not sure. But I just want you guys to know what you might experience. <coughs> okay, last but not least, it's the third part. Apply the moisturizing balm all over your face. Oh, let's see what this looks like. The moisturizing balm. Bam. That says apply over all over the face. I'm gonna use a finger's worth amount, index finger. I don't need a lot. And apply all over the face, and here we go. Now this smells excellent. It smells very good. Very, very good. I just hope it works as good as it smells. You know, just put it everywhere. Mm, all over. Don't forget the neck. Don't forget the neck. Okay. Well, this really helped with the dry feeling of my skin. It doesn't feel dry anymore. Okay. That's it. That was, this is the first day. Day one, Lumen, Men Care, whatever. Lumen's skin care for men, all right? All right, I'm gonna continue to uh, get ready for the rest of my day. I'll see you in two weeks and we're gonna see how good it turned out. Oh, so very quick, I wanted to say that I'm not a promoter of Lumen at this point in time. I've never used Lumen products. Um, I just want to see if the skincare product is something that might work for you, it might work for me. And if it does, I hope that, you know, the results can be progressed on forward. So my goal is solely to help you. That is all I want. I want to help myself too. I would like clearer skin. You know, when you have clearer skin, you just have an extra set of confidence. And I totally get just having blemishes and acne and breakouts and it sucks. And I have friends who have like flawless skin and they'll be like, oh, well, that's just how I am. And I'll just be like, are you serious? So, you know, everyone can be perfect. We're not all perfect. We all have our little problems. And, you know, I'm going to do my best to help you guys out and help myself out and enjoy the ride. I hope we have a good time. Sorry, I'm slowly getting ready for my day. So, you guys know that there are literally thousands of products out there that all claim that they're going to make your face perfect and great. And I think that's good. But a big thing I want you guys to know is not just the speed of what all of the videos and all of the products is, you have to just figure out what's gonna work for you. Um, there's a lot of research and you know, I hope that something that I said in this video helped you or you know, you won't make the same mistake that I made, you know, about like the things about the talent. There's a lot of other types of um, techniques and methods you can use. I've heard a lot about witch hazel. I have not personally used witch hazel, but you know, that's an option. So just don't forget that this is not the only option. There are plenty out there. And just, you know, don't be afraid to try. I'm not saying like, try one and then stop. You have to be consistent for a specific amount of time. And if you see improvements, continue to use the product. If you don't, change. It's totally okay. It's a process. You're not gonna get everything on the first try. It never works like that. So, you know, stick with me. I'll tell you how my results are and I hope your results are great. And last but not least, if you like this video, if you want more content like this, click subscribe, let me know, add some comments down there. And um, I'll see you guys next time.